Hello guys and welcome to the stream. So, well, I, uh, I actually did nothing. Um, by the way, just uh, I think if you just got any ideas, just put it in the chat. I will just try to keep up with the chat and just uh, try to implement everything. Um, at least if it is possible, if it is not too big and, and, and so on. So uh, let me just quickly explain what I already got. Uh, some assets from my other game. Uh, some buckets and anvil. I know this is spelled incorrectly, or by the way, <laughs> um, some barrels and so on. And um, we got also um, the very first script already. It's just an empty script, so we just had this startup, um, a texture atlas. Um, where we will just put all the textures in and an empty Blendify where we will create all the artwork. Um, <laughs> yeah, Matthias is my uh, neighbor, so if he screams, he will probably uh, he will probably hear it on the live stream. By the way, that's not real because I got the microphone. So let me just explain. Uh, Nightbot is Ernest. Nightbot is um, a program who will actually. Uh, make sure that people don't spam and so on and we'll just every 15 minutes they will just send uh, a message um, let me just begin quickly with some uh, prototyping and while i'm just doing this i will just explain quickly the the idea of this game so it is uh you are trapped inside the chair inside a cave and every five to, uh, to ten minutes you will get a wave of enemies. It's also standing, by the way, in the description. So if you just missed the half of it, you can also read it there. Um, and you will try to survive everything. And between the uh, the waves, you will have time to explore all the other cave biomes and things like that. And we will create that together. If you got an awesome ID for your biome, I will try to implant implement that. <laughs> and also, we will just well try to create an awesome game that people want to play and not like an angry or a, a Flappy Birds clone or whatever. Uh, so that's why I got this ID. Um, also, the very first question already is where is the player prefab? Um, first person characters, prefabs, first person controller. Nice ID. Thanks, Ernest. Thanks. Um, I don't know for for sure if you are able to make this within a few hours, but I hope so. So let me just test this quickly. Also, is there if there is any lag, please say so. I will just try to fix that. Um, I don't know if I uh, am able to, but you know I do, I can see it. Um, uh, Create a deed. Thanks also uh, DJ. Uh, we talked on Facebook once. Yeah, that can happen. I don't know. Uh, a lot of people talk to me. Uh, it seems like this is working. Awesome. So the very first thing I think we should do is create a basic script of the player movement, walkment, uh, whatever. So here's the script. First some basic variables like um, what's important for the game. Um, health. Also always add health. So public int and called health. And here we are going, also we're going to create something called money, of course, because you need to buy uh, all the biomes and things like that. Um, so some money. And let's see what's also important. Um, well, just think of something and uh, say it in the chat and I will try to implement that. For now I think health is the most important thing. So. We will just create a public void uh, called uh, cat damage with an um, int of the damage, and we will just well just take it away from the health. So minus uh, stamina. Good ID uh, DJ. Um, public int stamina. Um, by the way, it's a robot. Uh, you are a robot, so 
everything you need to think of it inside robot or robotic teams and things like that. Um, also, your input is very important. I can't create a game within the four hours uh, without your help, guys, because there's a lot of thinking uh, about this. Uh, let's just make this 100. And I can do that on my own. Energy. Uh, what do you mean with that? Um, also, we need to check if it's more than 100, because then you are cheating, so we need to remove that. So we need to make it again 100. And also, if you add um, something like like a potion or whatever, we also want to check that. Um, and also, we need to check if it is less than zero, because then you will die. Uh, we will not do anything with that yet, but we will just create a public void uh, die, and we'll just make an empty void. That's everything we will do for now. Um, I think that's fine. Uh, like the battery power of a robot. Oh yeah, for that, um, I want to use coal. Um, but in uh, indeed, we need to uh, to use that. Uh, thanks. A public int, um, well, let's just call it power. Um, and we will just, the, the power will be just, you got like one arm. We need to make everything very simplistic. So the arm of the robot is just going to be like one big, uh, um, one, one big, uh, fire maker thing, <laughs> which will just, you will uh, kill enemies with it, but you can always, uh, also mine things with it. That's the idea at least, uh, a public void, uh, update stats just for, um, uh, for example, for the stamina, because we are going to see if it's running or jumping or whatsoever. So for that, hello, uh, e -E -A -A -E -M games. Um, let's see, uh, we need to create, uh, we need to be with the FPS control. Where is that thing? We just need to open it so we can change some things in it. Uh, that's the idea. Uh, how are you doing, by the way? It's also very important that you guys are uh, having a great time. And we need to change some of those variables to public, like this one, public. And let's see, where is that it is jumping? Um, I guess we can just do that with, like if you're pressing space, that's automatically uh, notice that you will be jumping. Oh, and I see the chat is something missed with it in within the video. Also, is, if just something will happen, just say so because I don't see the uh, see always the stream. Uh, it seems like it's good again. Uh, maybe drop the chat right down in the file explorer. Um, yeah, we'll uh, we'll do that very quickly. Um, Oh, that's what, a little bit too much. Um, well, I guess it's fine for now. I can do two uh, difficult things while streaming. Um, oh, that went wrong. And we are going to go on. Um, we can maybe use this one, public. Um, is this better, by the way, DJ? Um, but for update stats, so we are going to do here the stamina. Uh, the stamina is actually almost the same as the power, actually. Let me just use only the power. That will make it a little bit more simple and also we don't need to use that. Um, awesome. Just say so, this is the very first time I stream, so I don't know uh, everything for sure. Um, so let me just see. We need to create uh, using unity standard assets dot characters dot first person dot, I think it was it. <laughs> um, uh, for uh, in the description, indeed, Ernest, thanks for uh, replying for that. That's just the whole 
what is going to be about and we don't want to say it over and over again for the people who will be staying here for a bit longer. Um, so the power is going to be a limit of 1000. So the very first thing we're just going to make sure that people won't be able to cheat. Uh, so if this is bigger than, oh, bigger, than a thousand, the power will be thousand. Um, uh, it doesn't matter EAM games, you didn't know that. Um, as far from here, what shall we do? Very first, if this walking. So if, um, oh, let's just create uh, a public first person controller variable. So fpc dot uh, walking is walking. Awesome. Uh, we will also make here like it will detect if it is running. So we also need to do that. And I think, um, hello, the long run. Um, I think we will only want to to subtract power from it if it is uh, running. Otherwise, it will be very annoying. Um, or what we can do is just, uh, are you going to make it co-op? I don't have Potem, by the way, DJ, and it will uh, wait, become way too complex for just four hours of streaming. Um, if this walking, we need to make, uh, we need to make sure that this, uh, how hard you go, this, uh, uh, how more power will be subtracted from you. So I think what we are going to do is power minus um, Ibrian, this is awesome, but we have to go to work now. Will you be uploading the streamer's video to YouTube as well? Yeah, I will do that, Ibrian. It will just become within parts. So every, I will just split it in 15 minutes episodes or something like that. And it will just come next week or whatever. It will come to YouTube. So don't be afraid. Hello, uh, GFL, or whatever I have to uh, uh, say that. Um, power. We will add it minus, um, is there a walking spree? We need to create this rigid body controller, right? This rigid body, yeah, awesome. So we can use the rigid body to actually see the speed of the of the player. So, um, re oh, this is the wrong function. Rigid dot velocity, I think. Yeah, magnitude. Um, multiplied by, let's say, dot something like this. No, I think this is still too much. Uh, something like this. We'll just check it out when we are playing the game. And we also need to save this convert. Um, bye, uh, Ibrion. See you, see, I will see you soon with videos and you got any idea on how to do a power crit like in Fallout? What do you mean with that, the long run? Uh, do you mean uh, you want me to create a, a tutorial about this or in this game or how do you want to implement it? Um, so this is, let me just check if this will work. I think that's, uh, that's very important for this and it doesn't work. Awesome. Um, it seems like I've got to add something. A private public. Yeah, that's not going to work. Um, a public pool. That will work, probably. And it works. Oh, <laughs> flow to an int. Um, adios. Um, hello, Hilgert. Uh, interesting to see some live gaming programming. Well, you are welcome. Um, there is something going on. Oh, I already see it. This needs to be a float. So the power needs to be a float. Otherwise it will just go terribly wrong. Um, so let us just add all the things. 